Hello, and welcome back. Uh, this is Steven and Ben playing The Hobbit, uh, episode two. So, <laughs> so, we are searching for the hammer and nails to fix the bridge. And children. And children, yes. Children. <laughs> Not to eat, they're playing hide and seek. Okay. You can't kill the chickens, you can't eat the children. What is <laughs> My children insist I tell them all about dragons. Where do they ever hear of such creatures? Respectable hobbits don't discuss such things. <laughs> I'm Miss Snooty Snooty Snoot. Probably a... Uh, Miss Snooterson? Yes. Okay. Probably a uh, Gandalf's fireworks probably clued them into dragons. Yes. Just Although, saying. I thought that happened... Well, he, yeah, he did it before, I guess. I mean, I'm assuming he did it before. Hey, look, monies. And we can use... Hey, quick way up. To grab you guys and talk to him. <laughs> no, you thing. got me! That was fun! <laughs> that actually wasn't that nice, but... No, it, it's really hard to see from down there. I'm but just you... gonna hang out in this barn for the mess. <laughs> Yes, uh, okay, I think I'll just get the stuff up here, then go back to Carl, who has his father's hammer. Uh, I just love this movie. Yeah, I have to be careful, because fall damage is a thing. Mm -hmm. Now that you're not in dreaming, you can actually get lift. Yeah. And water's not safe for me to land in, because I'll drown if it's too deep. Although this is not too deep. So, I like that the flowers open up when you, uh... Oh, cool. ...land on these petals, or uh, lily pads. <laughs> this is an enchanted land! <laughs> the flowers open up and little gems come out! Yep, and... I want no, some! I just got 100 Gurge points, because... I don't know... I guess, you know, they, since they had, uh... Courage points on there, they were like, Well, this is gonna make the player want to jump from lily pad to lily pad. And if they get across without falling in the water... We'll give them more courage points. What happens if you do fall in the water? Do you not get all of them? You have to uh, go back and try again. Oh, interesting. Okay. Uh, yeah, long jump. I mean, if I fall in, it's. I guess almost shoulder deep. Mm -hmm. Which to us is like. Well, which well. to me is like <laughs> hip deep. <laughs> yeah. It's like deep. I mean, hobbits are like small children. Uh. At least, you know, Aragorn said they, they'd appear no more than a small child. So they're small children, this <laughs> Yes. Infants. So. We little things. We. We bobbies. We bobbies. <laughs> yes. We, we Scottish. <laughs> that was a terrible accent, probably. It's okay, no one's ever gonna hear it. We're not putting <laughs> this up on YouTube or anything. Yep, okay, I think if I go like that, yes. <laughs> a little bit of a jump there. It didn't look like physically I could make that, but oh well. Link suspension of disbelief. It's video game. It's not real life? Then you're ruining my immersion. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's everything. Yep. Uh, save here, and as uh, you don't get more courage points for doing the same thing on these lily pads. However, so much of the blues were blues are worth one. So yeah, it's like barely going up. Shrooms. <laughs> so yeah, in this game you get health back by doing shrooms. Nice. That's your uh, if if you don't use a health potion or don't have any. Ooh, take some shrooms. Not just any shrooms. Magic uh, green the and blue shrooms. Levitating. Yes. They are levitating and shrooms. glowing. Something tells me they are not safe to eat in real life. Hey, Carl. Oh, wait, look. Our first health potion. Pardon me, Carl. Do you have your father's hammer? He needs it to fix the bridge. Here it is, Mr. Baggins. I'll have to find something else to play with. <laughs> <laughs> Good parenting, everyone. Note to self. Hammers. When I have child, childs, yes, I said childs, let them play with hammers. Yep. Remember, kids, hammers are dangerous. You could stub your toe or something. Bust a thumb. Bust a 
so I, get, I don't want to fall all the way down because then I would take some damage, but I do it the safe way. And since I don't want to walk on water, there. Dry land moves a lot faster. <laughs> Um, I think we've got everything in this area, but I'll just ride up the wheel for fun again. And down the other side. There we go. Oh, a little dingy. For barriers. Good Here lad. we go. This shouldn't take long. Three hours later. Thanks for flash forwarding that. Good is new. The magic of video, video games. And we didn't even have to edit that. Nope. Here we go. Hello, Bilbo. Oh, we still need bummer. more supplies for our journey. If you happen to find any provisions, bring them back to me. Now, why would Bumber want food? He's hungry. <laughs> well, I mean... Sorry, my creativity's a little low today. <laughs> It's not like he's the fattest dwarf I ever Good morning, Lorella. Good morning, Bilbo. Bumber the dwarf tried to buy some sugar and spice, but I couldn't find the keys to my spice chest. Your mother Stupid. had a talent for opening Obviously. locks without a key. Do you have that talent too? Pick the locks on those chests and you're welcome to all the spices you need. Remember kids, ask your friendly neighbors if you can lockpick their stuff and they'll give it to you. I think I'm definitely going to have my kids play this one. <laughs> so, I really love the uh, lock picking mechanism, so essentially what happens is I have to match up the green, of course. There's all that black and green. Sugar and, acquired. Yep. And so, there's a whole bunch of different oop, mechanisms. And so, red is bad, green is good. Simple. And then if I get it wrong, it makes that little DD sound, and it fast forwards the time. That upper right hand was a timer. Oh, interesting. So if you fail to lockpick a chest, it uh, will usually hurt you. If it, um, that's a mean chest. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it it looks like a small explosion, and then it takes away a bubble or two. Remind me to design locks that do that, because that's <laughs> awesome. Or the chest will poison you, which is a pain in the butt. Yes. Ah, come on, okay. What I'm, what I'm trying to do here so people don't think I'm an idiot is show uh, everyone a glitch. <laughs> because if I stand here and pull vault towards the... Oh, darn it. Okay, I'll, I'll redo it. <laughs> Trapped in the sign. Bad dragon! Bad dragon! Because what happens is... There we go. Wait, the woman was like, oh, wherever did my children learn about dragons? Oh, I don't know. The green dragon? Oh, oh it's levitated. Oh, here we go. Here we go. I did, uh, so if I pull vault onto the horse, I am now trapped. Trapped in the in horse. In the horse. I literally cannot move out of here. <laughs> but I can just talk to uh, Feely or Keely here. Bravo. Keely. You made it in time. The others are waiting for you inside. I don't think when you are ready to leave Hobbiton, just open the door <laughs> no. to the Green Dragon Inn. I mean, these are more realistic looking dwarves in my opinion. Realistic looking dwarves. Yes. <laughs> Do you realize what you just said? Yes. <laughs> I think they look more dwarvish. Okay. Okay, nothing back And Instead of just like hot guys wearing suits that make them look kind of short. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so if we check on our progress, you'll see that, uh, hey, I found those guys. Still haven't found Grandma's sewing needle. Uh, need the sewing needle, got all these foods uh, that I haven't actually brought to him to, because I, I just like getting all the food and then giving to him all right, at once. Yeah. Saves time. Open her chest. Not her chest, anyways. <laughs> okay. Ignore that. <laughs> What are you, a heart surgeon now? Yes. Good day to you, Mr. Baggins. Hello, Hellman. Oh, that's it. Uh, I, was, I, I forgot that that one was kind of boring. It's friendly anyway, I guess. Yeah, he's friendly, but That'd come on, give me, tell me something interesting. I'm just walking on your you roof. Can't, you can't, like, peer into that window there up on the top and see what you see? No. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that, you know, that's just a yeah. blank slate. I could just see, like, a... 
Those scarecrows are useless. Yep. Look at those crows sitting there mocking me. I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> I'll give you a sack of wheat if you get rid of those crows. Deal. <sighs> Very well. Bill is like, that requires work. Shoo. Beat it. You think they'd be scared by that magic circle I create? Magic circle. Well, if you, if you look, when I do a jump attack, there's a little glow oh, yeah. there. Yeah, that'd freak me out. Aha! Now give me my wheat. This bomber Thank wants you, it. Thank you, Bilbo. I thought I always never do get rid of those crows. Wheat. Well, he'll complain that he's hungry if we don't give him all the food he wants. Let me get this straight. You're now carrying around a bunch of sugar, a mm -hmm. couple of sacks of wheat. One sack. One sack of wheat. Okay. Some spice. Uh, tea cakes or tea crumbles, something, and apples. They were very huge apples now that I think, that mm. I think about it. Well, when you're that small. Yeah. Who's creeping Ooh. around the berry patch? Uh-oh. Who do you have to beat up? We have to uh, sneak because if he if he talks to us, if he catches us, uh, he'll board here. I'll just show you. Hey you! Oh, Bilbo! Hobart! <laughs> I thought That's you were a badger. Name. Chasing badgers is not good for my back. Have I told you about this ache? <laughs> <laughs> it's the old man that talks your ears off. And then, oh, here I'm back at the safe. There we go. Now, yep, here I'm gonna change the camera angle. There we go, so that I can actually see. Eh? What was that? <laughs> eh? What was that? Get off my lawn! The Hobbiton and people around it must love badgers, because I think one of the things he says if if you hear something and then nothing else, he's like, oh, it must have been a badger. Rotten ba he says, rotten badgers! That's right. Come out of there, badger! <laughs> badger! I know you're a badger. Unless he's talking about the guy from the Oh! I, I somehow doubt that these two, uh, the hot, the, that the Hobbit game and uh, Firefly universes collide. There we go. I got all the berries. Quick, save, save. Yes, save so I don't have to do that again. Okay, now let's uh, bring this to a more normal there. Camera angle. You're looking a little thin, Bilbo. You don't want to waste away, do you? I love how she's just Hobbit to me. Yeah, she doesn't need a name. Hey, you're thinner, skinnier than me. But I guess females are supposed to be skinnier. Or oh. something. According to America's society standards. <laughs> I was gonna say, you might want to be careful. I, I meant no offense to anyone. But people might take it as offensive. All these are, see, now this is the best hiding spot out of all of them, in my opinion. Chillin'. You're too good at this game. <laughs> That's right, I'm a hide-and-seek master. They should have a game like that. Hide-and-seek master. <laughs> hide-and-seek pro. Or challenge or something. Okay, so if you look at these uh, odd-colored, mm. they squeak and wake up all the chickens. They get angry, because they don't like people stealing their eggs. Right. <laughs> What's that about so, chickens th this rushing game... at you and killing you? <laughs> yeah, th this game does have uh, chickens rushing at you, but not from attacking you, from uh, disturbing their sleep. So I'll just sneak. Is sneak like a... Oh, holding down Control. Down. Oh, okay. It's a common mechanism for games. There. <laughs> a little bit, bit of good time. Oh, what? I swear I didn't. <sighs> I made an awful lot of noise with all that ka ching, ka ching. But they, they can't hear that. That's like a player knowledge, not chicken knowledge. <laughs> oh. Oh, crap. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> what the? Oh. It must have been a delay. Okay. This time I will do it. I'll just to go the slow and steady wins the race. Oh, 
I still want to do this. Okay. Okay. We're good. <laughs> well, I need to get out of here still. Ha! <laughs> ah! <Oop>! It's okay. <laughs> little, uh, little, uh... Emperor's New Groove reference. Oh, yes. <laughs> I love how you can't die in this level, right. but you can. There we you go. Know. You can get chased by chickens or badger. Talk your ears off about badgers. Okay, here we go. I knew there was a coin behind one of these trees. I have all but one coin because there's a hundred coins on this level. You haven't spent it. Yet. No. Um. There. Oh, there's her needle. There's that. Wait, is it just me or is it in a haystack? Yeah. <laughs> They, they, they make that joke. That's a rather <laughs> obvious gigantic... <laughs> I leveled up and gained a new health bubble. Okay, where's that uh, coin that I missed? Check in here make sure I didn't miss any... anything... How many more children are there? I think we found them all. Let's see, so we'll go through our quest. Uh, get Emma sewing needle, so we need to return that to her. Provisions, uh, we're working on that. Find the four... Ham fast. fast. Oh, I know where the last coin is, that's right. Okay, so a while back when we were walking down to Hobbiton, before we got to the area where I climbed up to get the apples, there was a fenced-in area before we went down the hill, and the gate is now open because uh, Hamfast went and hid in there. Right. Okay, so that's what essentially the... We, well, now we, we go back, we have Gamma her needle, and uh, find that last child, and then just give the food to Bomber. Bob's your uncle. Yep. Remind me to name a child Hamfast. Would, uh, the fiancé approve? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> She's all over that. She wouldn't let me name, any, name anything a bug name. But... I wonder why. There's some cool ones. Names that are good for humans? So uh, I, think, I still gate. think ephemerella is pretty cool. Maybe. Sarah, Sarah Tella. Okay, I guess she could go by Sarah. Here's or Tella. That. Or Tella. Sorry, but... Yeah. How did you find me? Um, I don't know. You're standing in the middle of a field. I mean, I, I did have to go through a gate to find you. It's true. It's true. But you left it open. So, there's a little book that appeared. What, what's that about? Where? Sometimes oh, oh, yeah, yeah. That book appears is uh, with an exclamation mark. That's uh, letting you know you completed a quest okay. part. Uh, either required or not. But now we talk to a uh, gamer. Oh, Bilbo, did you find my quilting needle? Here it is. Thank you, Bilbo. Please take these sausages. The best in Hobbiton. Man, I find a quilting needle for sausages. <laughs> I got all the food bomber. Yeah, Hobbits are nice want, with their food. At least for the afternoon. <laughs> Please. Is that a and then joke? What? No. And then uh, there's a little glitch where you can see that I kind of like hover in there for a second before I jump. Straight down as I'm going downhill with the uh, thing. Yeah. Like there's a little. Like there should I, be ground. Yeah, there, there, there should be ground, and then I fall mm -hmm. just because. You know, it's not a perfect game, but it it has a lovely atmosphere and story. Thank you, Bilbo. Perhaps you'll be some extra <laughs> All the all. courage, boys. Now get into the Green Dragon Inn. The others are waiting. Yeah, um... Oh! Did he not say it? Um... Wait, did I miss? Something? No, I got all the quests. Um, usually, when I get all the food items, uh, Bilbo says, that should be all, uh, all the food that Bomber could possibly want. At least for the afternoon. At least for the afternoon. Yeah, did that's he, what did he, say? Yeah, he said that, and that's when I, I said just, that, is that a fat joke? Oh. 
I I completely missed that. I thought you were talking about the hobbit the, oh. the thing I said where a hobbit and woman are free with their food. <laughs> I could okay okay. So now as you see, hey, we got all the coins, all the curse points, and chests. So the last quest is go to the green dragon. <laughs> well, what is it? You can drink your blooming ale. You can drink it by the flagon. But the only brew that's brave and true comes from the green dragon. Uh, what Mary and Pippin sing it, uh, at the end of the second movie? Oh. No, it must be in the third. When they, when so, everyone's so, ce celebrating in the hall, they're dancing on a table singing that song. So let me get this straight. Even, even, like, even little bars, taverns, mm -hmm. in Middle Earth had theme songs. I guess so. I bet you they heard it, like, <laughs> over the radio, and was like, I think over the Green Dragon. Thanks, marketing. Thanks, <laughs> awesome. Anyway. Eh. Well, now we can, uh, why not save. just quick save. You never know what's lurking behind that door. There, and after that, uh, we should It's about time you arrived, Mr. Baggins. Let the journey begin. It's a cute little building. But yeah, uh, so we'll stop the episode here and, uh, continue on later. See you guys.